legacy platform. That sounds cool and respectable, right? Ah! We are going to talk about modern software development, vulnerability to hackers, and why you should never click later on a software update banner. <laughs> In the context of operating systems, legacy is used to mean an operating system that is no longer in use, aka has been replaced by something that works better. And before you fight me on saying this feature or that feature is so much better and I just like it more, allow me to stop you. I don't care how well you think it works. If it has been replaced, it does not work well enough. And here is why. At this very moment, current softwares are being tested and updated by software developers. Patches are being issued to fix bugs, improve UI, but most importantly, to secure the software against known vulnerabilities. Here, vulnerabilities is used to mean weaknesses in the software that can be exploited by hackers. But the scary thing is, the known part doesn't necessarily imply that it's been fixed, it just means we're aware of it. We have identified this vulnerability and we acknowledge that it is a problem. If the software is current, a team of software developers will get to work on what's called a patch, a fix to solve the issue and protect you against anyone who knows how to exploit the vulnerability. The next time you install a software update, which you should do every time it is requested of you as soon as it is requested of you, you will receive this patch and be protected once again. But from the perspective of software developers, legacy means no one is working on this anymore. Thus, any vulnerability your legacy operating system has, no one cares. No one's gonna fix it. No one is coming to help you. And you know how modern apps don't run on old operating systems? That means you won't be updating any of your programs as well. Thus, any vulnerability in those programs will not be fixed. Not because no one has fixed it, but because you refuse to allow their hard work to do what it was meant to do. Protect your business, protect your data, protect you. Software developers don't push updates for our help. We do it for yours. The most exciting thing about the field of cybersecurity is the minds of the people who are working within it, but that means both red and blue teams. The tools that pen testing professionals and black hats alike are trying to use to compromise your systems are literally evolving every second. The defense systems are evolving as well, but you won't get those evolutions if you don't click the software update button. I get how easy it is to get attached to a workflow, a UI, a software environment that you like. As a business, it may seem too daunting to update a system that you've built lots of infrastructure and functionality on. But here is one thing I will promise you, the consequences of a major security breach will prove far more inconvenient and damaging than the time it would take to install an update. Think of it this way. When, not if, when, when you are compromised, not only will you have to undo all of that damage, you will also have to go through the process of updating your entire system. So wouldn't you rather do half the work? And the longer you wait, the more incompatible your software becomes, the more workarounds and patches you'll have to cobble together for yourself, and ultimately, the more things you'll have to replace. Leave a note in the comments if you promise to never click remind me later on a software update banner again. <coughs> also, if you came from TikTok or the Discord server, this special hello is for you. You are not satisfied with just knowing that things work. You're making sure that you know how. That's gonna take you so far, man. Now we're family. Stay excellent. If you work in a place that runs on a legacy operating system, feel free to show this video to your bosses. And bosses, if you have questions, feel free to at me. Please note that this video was made in partnership with Grizzly Shield Services at Intent Solutions Group, a truly brilliant team of truly awesome people that I am deeply honored to be a part of. Stay safe, kids. Till next time. I leave my window open, pretend you come inside, can't fix what isn't broken, can't miss what isn't